Okay, Holly Flat Raider. Heat lens heat valve for the primaries. Needle and seat valve for the secondaries. It's both the same needle and seat valve, they're interchangeable for the two. If you've got a big flood of fuel in your primaries, clean and or change that needle and seat valve. If you've got a big lake of fuel in your secondaries, clean and or change that needle and seat valve. So, this right here, this is just a locking device to lock the adjustment in place. Kind of a set screw, so we'll take that out. And then underneath it, there's a gasket right there. Now that that set screws off, there's nothing holding on, holding this thing on. Okay. And what's left after you pull this adjusting nut off is the needle and seat valve and there's a gasket underneath so a gasket on either side of that but to take it out just go like that after you note pretty much you know how far up it's sticking because that's going to actually adjust your float level and, ad and uh, adjust how much fuel you're going to have in the bowl um, in either one this one I've got a sight glass so I can see how much is in my primaries and for some reason I don't have a sight glass on the secondaries. They have a tendency to break. So that's probably what happened there. Anyway, the needle and seat valve, I'm just unscrewing it now using the two flats on the bottom of that. Just lock that on there. Alright. There's the needle and seat valve. Okay. There's a O-ring on it. Looks like mine's coming apart a little bit. And then it just comes apart. Right there. Got the rubber seal in there. When the float arm float gets high enough, the arm lifts up, pushes that up, starts stops the flow of fuel, and then back down like that. So you just get some uh, B12 chem tool, something like that. And this is the last time a B12 chem tool. It wasn't much there. Anyway, let me put it back in there after it's clean. Use this to adjust your height back down to where it was. And it was about right there. I can use my sight glass later, run the engine and uh, check the float level. If, the, if it's too low, I can screw this back down. Um, rather, if the float level is too low, I can screw this out a little bit to raise how much fuel is in there. And uh, if, it's, uh, if it's too high, I can screw it down some more. So screwing it down some more will lower the level of fuel in your, in your fuel bowl. And uh, taking it out will, uh, will raise the fuel in your bowl. Then I just set this on there. Take the set screw. Now I don't want to inadvertently um, get this thing out of adjustment while tightening the set screw. So I'll hold it with a 5 8 open end while I tighten this set screw down.
and then all it needs is a leak check. And it's the same for the primaries or the secondaries, exactly the same thing.